to a bad New Zealand. We are here. I'm not sure we're on the road somewhere, and we have caught into this original dairy factory, butter factory, and uh, we'll talk to the owner, Joyce, and she'll tell you guys a little bit about it. But yeah, so hope you enjoyed this. Thank you. Hey, everyone, so this is a new camera I'm trying out. I've just brought it recently, so I'm trying to see how good it will be to give you guys videos with. So leave me down in the comments if you like it or not. Soon I'll be talking to Joy and she's going to give you some history about this place. She knows a lot more about it and I think, I think what she knows is amazing. So hope you enjoy this. This is, going, this is a seriously cool building. Look at the roofs. That is cool. Look at a bird. Ah, uh, last a bird. Last a bird. That is cool, isn't it? So this was actually the original dairy factory. In Butter Factory, which is really cool. Look at awesome roofs, they are amazing. So, yeah, so she's owned it for 13 years and actually doing a house up outside. So, I this footage isn't very good because I'm not used to using a natural camera. So, um yeah, forgive me, but I will be doing another one on my phone just for backup. That's cool. Well, big in into this is my sister's like the um, yeah, I think that's pretty cool. This is over there. Oops, this is. I love how everything's still original. I know, I love it. You need to come over here. Put this phone. I will be keeping it original, or there won't be any. We unfortunately had to put this door in here because the guy in the room me just roared in through here with his trap. Just knocked cool. down a window really? and a door, the original door. Really? Yep, just come in here with his tractor. He wanted oh, yeah. to put his tractor inside, so that's how he did it. That's so rude. There's T.I. over there in the corner. Oh, God, they are. They really get yeah, we have so many problems with people just destroying everything and vandalising. It makes it yes. so hard for us to go anywhere. Oh, that's right. Nobody, want, nobody the trusts council, anybody. The, the council doesn't even have a register of historic places. Really? Oh, that's sad. And Kuiper is one of the really old areas. Really? Yep. By John Stewart, who also built, 20 years later, our hall up the road. Uh, this is Hakaru, which was a much bigger settlement than either Mangawai or Kaiwaka. When the boats came into the Mangawai harbour, they would carry their loads through the day and where they got to come nightfall was where they stayed. That really? was Hakaru. That's oh, how wow. Hakaru was built up. Oh really? We had wow. I've got a list of things over there uh, that we used to have here. We had um, a police station, a courthouse, Whoa. blacksmith, livery stables. We even had a ladies finishing school. Well wow, this is pretty big. We had two or three uh, we had a, uh, yes, we've had a golf course, we've had tennis courts down here. Really? But they got fed up with the pavilion being um, washed away. So oh, wow, that changed. is so cool though. We had uh, livery stables, as I say, we had a general store and a post office. And across That's huge. in the next door paddock used to be a uh, the original pub, which was... Uh, put there in the 1860s, I think. It burnt down. They had to use the license. The license had to be kept on on premises that were open to the public. Wow. Uh, all of the time. So they immediately took the license and rushed it over to Mangataroto. Oh, really? And it can still be seen in the Mangataroto Hotel. Wow, that is seriously so cool. That, that, yeah, I, I thought that was wonderful. That is so cool. Um, we had a little soap factory. A lady uh, had a wee soap factory down here and made soap. Uh, right. Now and again, she'd make 
sand soap with ground up pumice, which really? we found along the Hakaru River, which bounds the place here. And they say that the pumice, it's certainly not um, normally found here, and they think it probably came from the Great Taupo eruption. Holy crap. So, it's a long way. A very, but it's a real long way. Very big eruption. Far out. Uh, the inside of the factory is lined with cowrie, which was milled oh. on the property here. Cool. And the uh, it was built here in the first place because we had rehab farms that the really? government opened for uh, people from, would you believe, the Boer War. Wow. And then also the First World War. So this was built in 1903 in order to take their, their cream. It was really it was old. It always a butter factory. The cream was brought in uh, at the front here the by front a horse and dray. Oh, I, uh, we'll see you later. They, they had a hatchway there, so it came through there and through here. It was um, whatever they were doing with well, it was done up here, then it went down into the bottom factory for the actual um, curing of the butter and the wrapping of it. And I'll show you the, the little um, cool room. Okay, that was so cool. Kept it in. And then it was all exported. Wow. And I have actually got a little tiny uh, unused stub really? of, of dockets. Wow, that, that is I awesome. That I found uh, down there. Uh, now, so they are, they must be nearly a hundred years old uh, because wow. the factory closed in 1933 or four. I've got differing opinions on that. Uh, at the same time, the Albert Land Dairy Factory also closed and the two districts were then serviced by the one that was built at Tihana. That was the amazing. The great big uh, concrete one. But uh, that was never as picturesque as this one. Or this the one looks amazing. Albert Land one, of course. Yeah. Uh, I don't know how many dairy farms this actually did service, but they must have had a reasonable amount of output for them to uh, send it overseas i would think otherwise they, they would have used it it's quite amazing how back in those days they, they still sent international from new zealand like we still exported like way back in those yes. days yes this that's would, cool this would have been one of the very very early uh exporters of butter i would think in, in those days